every single day of the year a baby dies from cot death. And on the 23rd of February 2006, that's what happened to my son Curtis. If someone was to say to me that they're going to put their baby in bed with them, I'd tell them that's the biggest mistake of their lives and not to do it. Even how tired they are, I persevere and put them in the crib or emergency bus where they're safe. I've had a mental breakdown and I can't care for my other children because of how just distraught and messed up I am. I've got fear of putting them to bed because the last time I said goodnight to my son, he died and he never woke up in the morning. Shit, it does my head in, Mum. Turn it off! What shirts are lurking around here? I've got a little weird one. You're alright, aren't you, darling? Anyway, Mummy's happy. You look knackered, love. Why don't you get an early night tonight? Lay her on her tummy to sleep like I used to do with you. She'll sleep much better then. Yeah? I'll try that. He's smoking again. I'm sick of telling him. What? You've been smoking? That's my case. I'm not in the mood for this right now. The window open. Anyway, how's my little girl? I'm having an early night. Alright, mate. I'll pass the remote control. to anyone. What could I have done? <laughs> if you've been drinking, or if you or the father is a smoker, you should never put your baby in bed with you. Ever. The 80% of cot deaths happen to mothers and fathers who smoke. Opening the window when you smoke doesn't do any good. You must never go to sleep with a baby on a sofa, either on your chest or on the sofa next to you. But she never settles in her cot. It was Tom that slept with the baby on the sofa. I just wanted her to be comfortable. But your baby has a 50 times higher risk of dying as a cot death if sleeping with someone on the sofa. You shouldn't have had Leo in bed with you. It's just safer that way, especially if you've been drinking. Your baby should also always lie on her back. Never front, never side, always back. Always in a cot, always on her back. Well, it doesn't really matter now, does it? She's gone. If I knew that was my last goodbye, if I knew that was my last chance I was holding the world, I never got that chance. I can't even remember it, and it is, it is sad for me. If someone really sat down with me and said, did you know your baby can die if it sleeps on the sofa? He would never have slept on his sofa. He would have been made to sleep in his cot whether he liked it or not. I would have sat up all night with him. But because that weren't a fear, because it's never been expressed to me as a fear before, I've done what I thought was best for him. And it turned out to be something totally stupid. <laughs>